Hey there everybody, this is the Savage Dingo. Welcome back to more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last episode, we went through the whole Woodfall Temple, defeated Oldua, and got all the fairies. In this episode, we are going to escort the princess and get some other items. What? Who are you? Dingo, pleased to meet you. I'm the Dooku Princess. Were you, by chance, asked by the monkey to come save me? Aha, just as I suspected. You see, your body smells a little bit like monkey. So, the monkey made it back fine after all. That's good. Those earrings look like her arms. I was worried that when I didn't come home, my father would think that the monkey had kidnapped me. I was worried that my father would even go as far as to punish the poor monkey. Hoo hoo hoo. She says father a lot. Don't tell me. Are you serious? Is father actually doing that? Yet another hasty decision, father. Case in point. Well, well, we don't have any time to lose. Quickly, Mr. Dingo, could you please find something to carry me in so you can take me to the Duke of Palace? No, we're just gonna leave you here. You got a princess in a bottle! It's a tight fit, but she says she'll be fine if you hurry. You see the letter out. Mm, Mr. Dingo, there's no time to lose. <sighs> hurry, take me to the palace. We are not going to the palace right away. There are still some things we can get here. Also, I hope that you guys can see the game better. I'm, I switched my recording method from, uh, uh, oi, I mind blanked, um, from a console with Dazzle to a emulator with Fraps. So hopefully the video will come out in much better quality. Also, I, like many other LPers I've seen, I'm gonna start doing like a main question per episode on. Something I've thought about, or something that has come to my attention. So, here's my question for this episode. What was the game that got you hooked on The Legend of Zelda? Hopefully you're hooked on it if you're watching this. Or what was the first Legend of Zelda game that you've played? Leave a comment below letting me know what game it was. For me, the one that got me really hooked on it was the classic Ocarina of Time. The one I remember the most though was Link's Awakening for the SNES. My favorite one though is this one, Majora's Mask. Just wish it could have been longer. Oh well. <laughs> oh strong young one, I'm the great fairy of power. Thank you for returning my broken and shattered body back to normal. As thanks, I grant you prowess with this new sword technique. <laughs> it's not really a new sword technique, it's an improved technique. <coughs> he has the power! You mastered the spin attack. Press and hold B, and we already know this. When you release your sword, it's just basically saying our sword attack just got a whole lot faster and better. Come see me again whenever you are overcome by weariness. Which is kind of sad, because she doesn't know that we turn back time, and when we turn back time, we have to collect the fairies again. So I'm going to show you real quick what it looks like now. Just like that. It's basically turned red like an ocarina of time. If you played that one. So, we are on to our next bit that we gotta collect. Fly! And something that also has come to my attention while I was watching uh, another LP here. Um, the mention of a different sort of rock, paper, scissors scheme for the starter Pokemon in the Pokemon series. Because for the past five generations, they haven't changed the scheme at all. It's always been grass, fire, and water. 
I also wanted to know your guys' thoughts on that. Um, what would be three good combinations of types that would work as rock, paper, scissors? A rupee. Just money saving. Oh, and I made it. Oh, yeah. Because, um... Yeah. Mind blank. Because, to me... Whoa. Um... It just seems like it's getting a little pre repetitive after what? <coughs> Excuse me. After like almost 20 years of game making, and the same concept has been hooked through all the generations. I know it was sort of a change up in Diamond and Pearl when they um did the uh. Uh, where... Nah, the starter Pokemon got a second type. Oh, my princess. My darling princess. You Are you alright? I was so worried. Foolish father. Boink, boink, boink. Come on, squint. Squint. Squint like you did before. Do. Sometimes if you get lucky, the guards will squint back. When I was playing the ocarina or trumpets, I should say, for the monkey before, they squinted as they went and mobbed me. Oh, Mr. Monkey, I'm truly sorry. Father does such rash things when he's worried about me. I understand, Princess. Forget about that. Has the tumbleman returned to normal? Okay, here's something I don't get. He was held over a pot of boiling water, or whatever, they dipped him in it several times, probably singeing and giving him third degree burns, or second degree, depending on how hot it was. And he says it's fine? I'm sorry, but I would sue people. I wouldn't just sit there and take it. Alright, we're gonna go get our third mask now. And hopefully one other thing while we're here. I can't get over how good the music is here. I'm such a sucker for flutes. And... It's coming up. Whatever that weird horn string noise is. I'm just a sucker for that kind of music. And tribal music. Alright, here is the part that I have dreaded. The race. Sort of kind of race. Dingo, I'm truly thankful for what you've done for the princess. As a sign of our gratitude, we Dooku have prepared something that we think might assist you. I will lead you to it. Please follow me. So now we gotta try and keep up with this guy as best as we can and not lose him. Also something I noticed with his voice and all the other Dooku voices, they're similar to some of the um, enemies. Oh no! No! They're similar to some of the enemies in, um, Yoshi's Island 2. We can catch up to him. We can catch up to him. And, um, I thought that was cool that they kind of reused it, but also it seems like it's kind of a lazy move. Alright, time to go, Ninja. We're gonna take the shortcut. And I recommend taking your time with it if you can, but not too much time. Because usually you'll get like three or four seconds ahead of him and he'll have to catch up to you. Then he just spins ahead and destroys the whole point of it. But I have the I have done this so many times for recording that I've practically memorized the whole path. It's kinda sad really. But eh, you get what you get. So how's everybody doing? A little late to ask, but hey, better late than never. So I'm doing good. And if you don't like any of the thoughts that I have, please comment below. I love getting feedback on anything, even if you decide to troll me. It's feedback. Maybe it'll change my thoughts in some way, I don't know. And there's a boulder there. Boulder dash. Rainbow dash. And there's a wall there. I think this is the last tidbit. 
There's like one more thing we gotta do and then we're at the end of the race. Yep. I hate this part too. Even though I get it every time, I freak out because I hit the wrong button. Just like that. Well, not the wrong button, I aimed wrong. I love that he doesn't even care that we're changing shape. He's just like, oh, you're still the same guy, so we don't care. You somehow turn into one of us, but we don't care. And that's the end of the race. Well done, Dingo. Now, here's an item I promised. Please accept it. You got the mask of sense. This mask heightens your sense of smell. Wear it to with C to sharpen your olfactory perception. Sniff, sniff. That's the smell of power. Actually, when I see you, I am reminded of my son who left home long ago. Somehow I feel as if I am once again racing with my son. I'm afraid I may have tried too hard to outrun you. As old as I am, I am still a fast competitor, just like when I raced my son. Please forgive my rudeness. And it also is believed that the stump that you see at the beginning of the game when you're first flying around on the flowers is um, the butler's son. Because, um, like have you seen, it, it takes a soul to create something to be able to be worn, like a mask. Except for with one mask that we're going to get later. So, we have some time, so I think I'm going to get one last thing. I'm trying to keep my video minute count low as possible, because that last one was just way too long. I apologize for it being long, and people who can't watch long videos like that. So, hopefully all my videos will be within a more reasonable time count. We're not going to collect any rupees from here because we're already full. Oh my gosh, that was close. Okay, we're going to fall behind him. I'm going to be all ninja with it. Oh yeah, oh no. Alright. That's the last thing that we're getting. Our third piece of heart. So, next time on... Oh, come on. It's never been so hard to get caught. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, we're gonna get... Yeah, do a couple sidey quests before we head to the mountains. See you guys then. He is so depressed, yet so sad. Wait, sad and depressed are the same thing. Whatever.